It's now almost six years since the Paris Climate Change Conference. In that time, we've seen ever more clearly the consequences of global warming. Yet the world has not made anything like enough progress in tackling the climate crisis. That is why COP26, taking place in my home city of Glasgow, is so important. It is the world's best chance, possibly one of our last chances, of limiting global warming to 1.5 degrees. And it is our opportunity to achieve that in a way that protects the vulnerable and builds resilience around the world. Scotland is determined to do everything we can to help deliver such an outcome. We're already committed to having net zero emissions by 2045. By 2030, we aim to have reduced our greenhouse gas emissions by three quarters compared to their 1990 levels. And we are working to ensure that our transition is a just one, to make sure that no communities or individuals are left behind. We also understand the importance of learning from and working with partners from around the world. That is why we place so much importance on the Race to Zero and Race to Resilience campaigns. It's why I'm proud to serve as the European co-chair of the Under Two Coalition. And it is also, of course, why I'm pleased to play a part in Climate Week NYC. This year's event in particular is hugely important. It provides a great opportunity for businesses, organisations and governments at all levels to come together and share ideas. And I hope it will help to raise the ambition and indeed build the momentum that the world really needs to see ahead of COP26 in Glasgow.